Cor hey, Corey, there's a very interesting looking collection here. Interesting? Yeah. Oh, interesting. Why not? Oh, it's terrible. Cover, covering dust. Dust? Oh. oh, yeah, look at the dust on it. Holy man, let's get a close up of that dust. Oh, my. <laughs> Holy cow. Well, there's anything good in there, that's the question. Yeah, look at that. Listening to the movies with Ferranti and Tiger. Any jazz uh, gems in there? Yeah, a couple of throwback records, but no gems. Corey, you look at some of those records? Yeah. They're filthy, those records. Oh my, that, that's no joke. Oh, you better wash yeah. that. You could have disease on there. Look at this equipment here, too. And uh, these are some huge ass speakers. Oh, I, yeah. I don't that's know. Look, that screen door in the front. All I need is a place big enough to put them. I wonder if this camera does them any justice. No, it's not big enough. See us some new arrivals. People like to flip through new arrivals. I don't know. Oh, I gotta get that that tape deck in there too. And what's that there? This? Yeah. The Crown tape machine with two preamps. It's on this pretty uh, custom cabinet here. Nice. Yeah. Big equipment day. Get a Tina's machine, Paul. She called me with a week. Well, Paul, Mayo yeah. likes um, Meatball Palm Heroes. He's good with that. You want some Meatball Heroes? Yeah, and a bottle of Coke. He's good with that. That might do right, it. Uh, when I get my money, I'll, I'll, I'll pick it up. Is there a place there you can get it here? So I can go. Uh, because because this is the place where I live, but the thing is, they all have until 11 or 12. So, can you want him to get it? Do you want him to get it? Want me to take him over there to get it or what? Yeah, if he you comes know. up to pick you, just give him some food. Give him some, give him some food. Give, 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 give him, yeah. Give, give him a hero and some Coke or Pepsi. He's good with that. And a pudding. Yeah. And pudding. Do you want to go with him to take it before, uh, do we go, before we go to the record store or pick it up? Bro? Yeah, no, eat with him. Sit down. He, he, he loves pudding. I'll go with him to the store, I'll go with him, we, 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 we eat together, right. It's going to be a party. He likes Lauren Hardy movies, too. You like them? Yeah, I love Lauren Hardy. Joe, do you have any Lauren Hardy movies? Yeah, he'll take you maybe uh, to the theater. What theater? There's a new Lauren Hardy movie out. Oh, uh, yeah? Joe, How you still got that know? Potluck album? I'm looking for Potluck. No, okay, yeah, I got to sell Mayo your Potluck because you never came in. He wants them. I never came in. You never came in, so Joey's Joe's gonna buy the uh, potlucks. No, come on, I'm coming in, I'm coming in, Joe, I'm coming in, don't cry, come on, Joe, I'm gonna buy a hero for him, then he's gonna let me buy the potlucks. Yeah, but I only want it if it's in mint condition. Is it mint? Oh. Yeah, Joe's gonna give me a buck and a half for the mint one. A buck and a half? I'm giving you more than that. I want you to give a buck and a half for a mint condition. You charge me more than that. It's not, for it. it's not worth more than that. I don't want to charge you that much. I'll pay you that. It's a brand. It's a brand. It's a condition. I'll pay you. No, I'll get you one for $20.25. So I'm going to sell Joe the one for $150 and I'll give you the $25 one. No, sell me the one for $150, Joe, or no dice. You promise you'd sell it to me. Uh, 200 I'll not, give you 200 I'm not going to do business with you anymore. He just I'm offered me. He just offered me 200 I can't. i got to think about oh, this. Oh, come on, Joey. You offered me 200 Wait, 150 is good. You said you always work with me for the good prices. Oh. Wait, I'm offering 150 for both each record. That's giving me 200 $300 for both records. Stereo model. All right, let me... Let me... Like, what if I offer you 200 for the mid one instead of the stereo one? I'll uh, give you 200 for the mid one. Not Paul. Don't waste your money. You can get... That's a lot oh, of food. Come on, Joey. It's not going to waste my money. I want to buy it. It's my choice. The customer's always right. Joe. Yeah. I'll give you 150 for the mint one. How's that sound? I'm going to think about this. Call me back at 2.30, okay? It's got to go, Paul. Bye. Oh, come on, Joe. I'm not going to keep calling you back all day. You're taking Joey's complaint. I called too much. Just, just have it ready for me, and I'll come in and pick it up.
You got it. I I'll, 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 I'll hold one for you. I'll, I'll hold the mint one for you. Don't spend the money like I did a long time ago in Levittown when you had the girls go to the girls when I went to Blockbuster. I remember you said, oh, you told me you were going to buy the girls. Go, go, you didn't buy it. I'm going to buy it. That was 30 years ago. No, remember, you remember the girls go to the girls at the wall? I was supposed to buy it. And you said, well, what are you spending all your money in Blockbuster for? You're supposed to pick up the record. I didn't pick it up. I made a mistake. I won't do that again. Yeah, you're wasting your money on Blockbuster. Now, where are those videos? They're all gone, right? <laughs> From your catalog, you got a lot of VHS tapes for Blockbuster. Again. Okay. Listen, John, I want to buy the mono one for 150. Okay, let me let me see what I can do. Let me get let me get rid of this guy out of here. Then uh, I don't want to sell it to him. Then I'll sell it to you. Get rid of him. I'll give you 150. You don't give it to him for a dollar. I'll give you 150, 200. He's screwed. So I'll give you 200. You got a deal, Paul. You're the best. I've been selling stuff to you for 30 years. I'll 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 do that. He's only been coming in here for like seven, eight years. You 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 got seniority. Yeah, so I get it first. I'll give you 150 for it. You got a deal. Bingo. You got it. Bye, Joe. Bye. What time did you think of? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got to love Paul. Yeah, you better edit that. <laughs> That's a lot of editing. Oh, my. Oh, oh I thought you were. But I see something there. Hold on a minute. It looks like Pepto on your chin. Right? I don't, you know, you all right with that? I know your stomach bothers you sometimes. Yeah. Don, how'd you make out today? I heard you went to the doctor. I'm mean, great. Make out great? Yeah. Good checkup? All the blood work came out great. You're in good health? Yeah. I mean, I'm glad for you. I'm just surprised, but happily I, uh, surprised. I who was human eating, left the window open. So now I got to take Claritin. And I thought it was expectorant, but he said expectorant is not good. Close out the way. So you're better off with Claritin. It'll clear out your nasal and your chest. Mm -hmm. So I gotta get that. I gotta get uh, new effects again. My antibiotic. How about you, big fella? No, I don't have. You take me in for a day. I'll take you in for a day. Got me for your mud or something. I'll lay down and stay on the carpet. Come on. I'll lay down and stay on the carpet. I'm gonna help me out. A little roach. You wanna sleep on my? I'm gonna make a quick hundred dollars. Friday morning. If you take me on Wednesday night to Friday morning. Take it, keep you in my place. Buy a couple of albums from Joe. Huh? What do you look at? I don't have room in my place. A little apartment. I had the special. Who cares? One day. I know. I used to. Who's gonna find out? I'll know. It's my breakfast. I didn't eat yet. I'll eat it cold. Oh my gosh. Excuse me, bud. Yeah, late for breakfast. How about you? Like make a hundred dollars extra? Get me for a day. That's tough. Do I want to make a hundred dollars? Yeah. I don't want to go there, Don. Hey, Mary, you want to make $100? What am I going to do? Oh. <laughs> nah. Don, ask Mary. Mary. Ask her. Hello, how you doing? How you doing? I've got a problem with housing and it's going to get cold one day Thursday. No, you say, Mary, would you like to make $100? I can't ask that. They're taking the wrong way. Yeah, and then Jim, Jim, what? How would she make $100? He needs a, how, uh, some place to sleep on the floor for a night or two. Oh, man, what am I going to do? I thought you had a place. And they keep the thing Wait open the real, but it's ice cold. Who wants ice cold? Hold on a minute. The last video that I had, you said you had a warm place. What did happened they, to did that place? Sanctuary where your father peaches, or? Because what she call it? Betty's stupid friend don't want me there. So that place you had is now gone. You know oh what? no! He's talking about the other place now. Well then, what do you you have well, a place? Wednesday I gotta work. If that stupid idiot comes around cleaning up again. Thursday's no problem. That's not a problem. When's it? Oh, yesterday the cops were across the street. It's only a problem because you make it a problem. It's only a problem because you create your own problem. I'm the phone number. I'm more than the master figure with you. What do you want, Don? I call my mom. They don't want to give hotel money. Hotel money is just a waste of money. No, and then you're going to take Betty in and some other people that don't deserve to be I there. I take nobody. So just me this time. And, I swear to God. You, you got that idiot now, bro. You can't be smoking crack and doing weed. I thought you don't do that. I thought I know, but your girlfriends do. Girlfriends? You got more than one? No. Yeah. Well, the lady who owns the apartment. You have a problem. Good, Don. You're a lady killer, Don. I know it. You're smooth, smooth, but you know, you give them the money. So they smooth, can Don. That's what we got to start. Can I borrow the 20? Oh, yeah. Give me a second. All right. Thanks. Appreciate it. Uh, I know you got to get that all back. Well. Tell me about the Lexus thing. You, He's got to kick me out of here. I know it. I want to spray You used to have the Lexus... You used to have a Lexus place. Oh, this is just Toyota shit. That's nothing. Look, I used to like them when I actually had the Lexus. Tell that them. That was better than the bed. The Lexus. Hey, hold on. And I ruined a couple of them, too. <laughs> you know what I mean? 
I know what you mean. You used to sleep. Tell them about this. You used to they sleep, know what uh, we God. mean. You used to sleep in parking lots with Lexus cars. You used to fight. They left them open. What would they leave them open for? One thing. No, not all of them. But some of them were open. You just had to know which one to keep on trying to get out. And you used to sleep in a Lexus and stay warm. Oh God, it was beautiful. You didn't, you didn't, you didn't like hurt your back or anything laying on that? No, you lay sideways into full side seat. Oh, you're it's small roomy. too. Toyota's so. not that roomy. Very roomy, honestly. I don't like Toyota. And then one day, a female cop busted you and found you. Oh, not because of snow in the footprints. footprints. Your footprints in the snow led up to the yeah, Alexis. And when she went in there, she found you in there one morning. <laughs> yeah, oh, she... don't you go. I have to the mail cop. I don't know if anybody knows that story, but uh, what'd she say to you? I look at it and get busted. They said, get me on your way and never come back again. All right, she gave you a break. I always, I always get breaks. She probably, you realize that story probably is, she'll never forget it the rest of her life, that story? She always remembers it, this one. Huh? Yes. How could she forget that? I think she retired now. Probably she didn't put it in when you oh, put I it see. Now we're here with uh, Julio. We go, Julio. And he's, look at this beautiful mystery tour. German, that is great sound quality, stereo. And I'm getting into vinyl again, just watching this man. Um, I mean, I, you know, I think all of a sudden uh, I might start buying a lot more vinyl than I thought I was. You called me on it earlier. You said it, right? Hey, you know, you you shouldn't stop collecting vinyl. It's a great oh, thing. Oh, no, no. I was going to go and go. But look at this guy eating again. Let him eat. How is that? Is it good? Or is it it's good. Yeah, it's, it's, not mu it's not mushy? Mushy? No. I like it. Yeah. yeah, that's how I like it, too. Yeah, you want, you want a little chew there. Yeah, a little chewy. Yeah. Mushy, no good. No good. Make, makes you think things. Exactly. And we got those beans going did too. Did you get Don? Did you get Don to sing for you today? By the way. Um, no, not today. He was in earlier. Not. He's looking for a place to stay. I thought he had a place to stay. I what? Feel bad for him. He's a good guy. I, I know. I know. Joe cares about him a lot. You do. Don't fail too bad. He picks. He he knows when he's doing the wrong thing. Yeah, well. That's what I want people to know who are viewing this because they, he picks they don't. He chooses his. Uh, I feel sorry for him, but I know what you're saying. People sometimes make their own help. He picked it. Yeah, what can I tell you? He has options, but that's what he does. And then he does, and then he's picky. A lot of homeless people I notice are like that. They they might give them shelter, but I don't want that. I don't. Yeah. Last storm, Betty and her friend gave him an apartment for two nights. Yeah. He didn't like it. He was upset because they opened the window in the place and made it too chilly. You're kidding me? No, I swear. And he's, that was he's very bitch. generous. He comes in here bitching. I said, wear a blanket, put your jacket on. Exactly. Yeah, you, you, that was on tape. I, I saw that. Yeah. Oh, wow. And, and I got to tell you something. I was saying to myself, what's he complaining about? He gave him shelter. Yeah, shelter, a place to eat, a bathroom. It shouldn't look a gift horse in the mouth. Gift, right? gift horse in the mouth. Yeah, I think that, I think that was very generous of you. Mm. Oh, this is beautiful. Yeah. So look, he's buttering him up because he wants a discount. This is beautiful. <laughs> this is beautiful. That's a nice record. Yeah, Anzo. I like it. I've never listened to it. Oh, the, the, the first dog track band. is hilarious. Play that first track for yourself. You'll be laughing. Yeah, I'm back into the vinyl. The intro and the outro, right? They're like a sad. They're, they're kind of like a satirical. Oh, Neil Innes. Yeah. Neil Innes, yeah. You know yeah, that? That's a that's that's a great. To me, that's their best album. To me, a lot yeah. of people like the Urban Spaceman album. I'm they the like Urban Spaceman. Track seven, Death Cab for Cutie. Play it for yourself. That's the one. Death Cab yeah. for Q. That's it. Yeah, that's what they do on Magical. Yeah, Magical Mystery. When you got tour. time later, play it. Okay, well. So you got you, you, you got Elvis good. Potluck and Stereo and Mono. <laughs> oh, God. You know, oh. if you get a hold of that, make sure you... Paul wants to pull him off. He keeps him calling me that. Hero if you, you get him. You want, me, you want me to pick Paul up? Yeah, we'll go together. Oh, I'll go together with you. That'd be a hell of a Just video. make sure you have his Potluck and Stereo and in Mono. <laughs> How many years has he been asking you for that? Thirty. <laughs> same one, the same copy. Same, thing, Thirty same years. copy. No, the, he's obsessed because I had a copy twenty-five or twenty-eight years ago on the wall, factory sealed. Okay. Loose bag, mm -hmm. you know that early sixties. Yeah, uh, that's the way they came. Yeah, and he wanted it, and I think I had it on the wall for seventy-five or a hundred loose bag sealed mono. And he didn't have the money. And hold that, Joe. Hold that, Joe. And like every year, go up in price. Go up in price. He wanted it, and you know, he never came up with the money. He had no money. And I would have given him a break on it. Sure. And I kept showing him reissues. I showed him sixties press. Hey, look who just came in. No, I don't want that. I want the first press. What's up, Don? Plastic and this and that. Cold out there. Never, never yeah, cold. You know, and eventually somebody bought it. 
So what have so, you made today? So you know, that was it. And it looks like nagging in his head now. So he wants it because of that. <laughs> he wants it because he never get it. You want to sing a few tunes? Sing, Julio's sing. requesting. Oh, Jesus. Sing something for him. <coughs> you should give him the mic and oh, set him up in the back. Enjoy. Got a phone call. Phone call. Who's that, Betty? Yeah. Don't give a crap. Answer, Betty. You're not going to answer to that's your girl. Huh? Why? She didn't, she's not gonna help me, so why she didn't help her anymore? Tell her you need 20 bucks. What? Tell her you need 20 bucks, answer it. She's got money from Andrew today. I ain't money from you, $20, no kidding around. <laughs> Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, so it's $20. I didn't borrow for four days from you. No, get, see if you can get 20 from her. I'll match the 20 if she gives you 20. You have, I don't want anything from her. Like He's not gonna give it to me. Get, I can pay the woman to stay there. You know what I'm talking about. Call her. If she'll give you the 20, I'll match it. Hear that? And I'll drop you off over there to get it. He will drive you there to get it and match I can. it. Yeah, I gotta meet this guy because I owe him some money. I gotta pay See, him back out of your twenty. Yeah, but you gotta pick up money. forty bucks. I borrowed, if you do this. I, I borrowed money from somebody. Who? Get that night warning. Don't you want? And now I gotta pay them ten dollars back. That's why I need your twenty and pay so them back. Who, who, and they're not who, who, nice like you, the bastards. I want. He's not like you, nice. He wants it back immediately. Hello? Make sense. Yes, what's going on now? You get money from Andrew or not? Because you're not going to take me and I'm going to be out in the freaking cold. It's not your problem. I thought we were friends and all that bullshit. So in other words, in other words, you know what I like to see happen? What happened last week, but I don't think it's going to happen. The woman gave me X amount of dollars to stay in the motel. Infinity. Infinity may help you. Infinity. 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 Uh, my check's coming tomorrow in the mail. They said it's coming February 1st. It comes at 5 o'clock at night. Can you pick me up maybe Sunday? Or mind if you said you'd pick me up, pick me up a sandwich if you come to see me because the other guy is off, you said? <laughs> yeah, he's off today. You want him to get you today? Well, he yeah, the, the, the hefty guy wants to be known mail. That's all. He wants oh, it. Okay. <laughs> Listen, Joe. He gained the weight from too much you mail. I call you Monday for the appointment. And the check's coming tomorrow. I called up Zappel. They said the check's coming tomorrow. The mail comes at 5 o'clock on Friday. Can you pick it up Friday night at the 5 or what? Or is that a good? Well, when are you going to have the money? I'm going to have the money tomorrow at 5 o'clock at night. check comes in the mail. The mailman brings it. Well, when you got the money, cash talks, money walks. I mean, we well, got I'll, have I'll have the cash, bro. I'll have the cash tomorrow. What day can you pick me up? When it's in your hand and you can count it off, call me up. We'll make a deal. Can you can't take me the cash in my area, the check cash in place? No, I'm not going to do that. Oh, you mean get it in my hands and call, call pick cash and then we'll talk? Cash yeah, reverse? get it in your little warm, grubby hands and we'll talk and I'll get you a meatball hero. <laughs> okay, thank you, bye bye. 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 Uh, you gotta love telephone Paul. You can't write that. Paul called. He's ready to come buy some records, okay? Okay, I'll let's see him. I'll play the next day. Gotta one, find it. 48, go. 1 p.m. Joe, the check just came. Pick up the phone, Joe. The check just came. Can you pick it up today? We'll go today, Joe. Joe, the check came. <laughs> Joe, call me back. The check came. He's I'm gonna cash it. Call me back first, and I'll tell you I'll cash it after that. Joe, the check came. I'm going to cash it. I have the money sitting. It came in the mail. Call me back. Wow, he really won't. He's, looks like he's going to be able to buy the records after all. Yeah, check came. All righty. Infinity Records, may I help you? Janelle. Yeah, who is this? This is, this well, is, this is Corey. Hi. 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 What's going on, Paul? Now, who is this? This, this? this is Corey. This is uh, the record store. What's going on? Oh, yeah. Yeah, Corey, I, I, I called yeah. Joe. There's a problem. My check, problem? one of the checks I cashed, I wasn't supposed to cash a bounce. Uh-huh, uh, uh, 
Sorry. They said something about they were charged a fee, so I won't oh. be able to go to Joe's store tomorrow until oh. it's straight down. They said they had to call Van uh, instead of a board tomorrow and find out if she could take some of the money out of my account or I had to take it out of my own pocket. I was ready to go to Joe to the store today. I got the check in the mail. I wanted to pay, have pick me up. But I want to enter cash the check. They said they can't cash it. They, they said they said they, they can't cash my check because the other check I cashed that expired. I wasn't supposed to cash it. I've been charged a fee. She said she's going to see what Jennifer Baldwin. She said I have to take it out of my own pocket. I tried to get hold of Joe early to tell him that I was, he could pick me up today. I tried to tell him that my check came in the mail, but I can't cash. Did you have Joe take me to cash it in uh, another check cashing place? Try another, the girl said try another check cashing place, baby. You see if you can get Joe to take me to another check cashing place. The one, the one Hicks won't cash my check. Yeah, I don't think Joe can. I don't, I don't think Joe can do it. Why not? He's busy. Yeah, that's right. Why can't he do it? You mean he want to do it or he can't do it? Uh, yeah, he can't do it. He's got a lot going no, he on. He can't do it. He's got a lot going on. Oh, he, oh, today you mean he can't do it? That's right. Oh, okay. Well, he told me as soon as I got the check, he'd been taking the care. Uh, he'd take me to, uh, to uh, take me to the record store and bring me up a meatball hero, he said. Mm, I Give see. me a ride to the store. Right, a right. His friend. And a hero? Give me a sandwich, a hero, he said. He's got that pot, he's, he's still got that potluck album. Joe, I can't. I tried to. I got my check came in the mail today, but I couldn't cash it because they said. No. They said because of what I did to the other No, no, check, this isn't I Joe. Tomorrow. This yeah. isn't Joe. She no, no, no. She said about stop payments on a check. This is a different Joe. Oh my! This is mayonnaise. This is mayonnaise, Mr. Mayonnaise. She said they. She said they stop payments on the. Oh, forget it. She told me. He thinks I'm Joe from the record store. Yeah, you know, your voice is on. <laughs> wait, what? Wait, what? I tried to cash the two hundred dollar nine fourteen dollar check. Have you picked me up today? Just close hands up. Wait, 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 hold on. Did you, try, did you try and cash it? I tried to cash it, and they said they said because they stopped payments on the other check. They said because of what I did. Because I, uh, I. Uh, they said because uh, because I cashed the check that I wasn't supposed to cash two weeks ago, a $37 check of financial management, that, that I'm getting charged a fee now. I might have to pay them back. I said, can you take it out of my account? She said, well, try to take it out of your account, so I won't hurt your check to go to Joe, the record store. Yeah? Joe? Hello, Joe? Wait. Joe? Wait. Joe? Uh, wait. Is hey, Joe hey, there? Hey, Paul, sorry. Joe? Hello? Can I speak to Joe a second? I'll make it quick. Tell him I want to try to get, I'm trying to get that check straight down so I can cash the one I knew when I All right. Hey, yeah, I'll let him know. I gotta go, Paul. Uh, yeah, we'll try uh, to figure this, we'll try to figure this thing out. Have a good day. Right. Holy mackerel. It's not going to do anything. I know. He's going to call you. I know, it's the exact seconds. same thing. It's been going on for years. Ask him if he tried to cash the check. <laughs> As soon as he picks up. <laughs> he said yeah, he said he ain't trying.